Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you this mutton dish inspired by Rogan Ghosh recipe. Mutton Rogan Ghosh did this in my version. Come, let's go to the recipe. For this, I'm going to use all these ingredients. Uh, please look at the uh, description for all the ingredients measurement. I'm going to use uh, shmiri chili or any red chili, curry powder, uh, Southeast Asia curry powder, some uh, brand like Baba's. Baba's curry powder would be like biryani masala, one tablespoon will do. Cherry tomato, you may use other kind of tomatoes also. One pound of mutton, about half a kg. Uh, some yogurt uh, during the... Uh, during the mixture, I'll let you know how much I'm going to use. I'm going to use the oil that I'm going to use is mustard oil. And uh, you're going to use considerable amount of uh, ginger powder. And this is my own garam masala. And fennel powder. One onion, uh, ginger garlic. This one, I, this uh, ginger and garlic I grate using this grater. Uh, I've just added the earlier the ginger garlic paste about one tablespoon into this uh, mutton. I'm going to just uh, marinate it. You can just leave it for about uh, 10 minutes or 15 minutes. I'm going to cut the onion very thin slice. I'm going to use this uh, mortar and pestle to instead of grinding, I'm going to use this. You might want to uh, uh, use a chopper to chop them. Um, this chili is optional. Kashmir chili is not spicy, so that is why I'm using this chili. To this, I'm going to add the uh, curry powder, two teaspoon uh, fennel powder, two teaspoon of uh, ginger powder. I'm going to mix them. This is going into the uh, while we are sauteing. I'm going to pour in uh, mustard oil, about four tablespoons of mustard oil. There's one important ingredient I forgot to mention. You got to use asperdita, about quarter teaspoon. So when this get very hot, then I'm going to drop in the asperdita. This will give a very fragrant kind of aroma. So if you don't have it, it's fine, but uh, it's good to use it for this recipe. The uh, oil has just uh, heated up. I'm going to now put in the uh, asperdita. This will give a very nice aroma. Now I'm going to add in the mutton. I'm going to add in the uh, cut onion. I add the cut onion first before you add the mutton. The main idea is to fry the mutton in this uh, mustard oil. So it's been like frying for 8 minutes. When you see the oil separate, so it should be like, can you see that? The oil has to separate like that. So it has to be like a long kind of frying. So now it's about 9 minutes of frying. This is only uh, 1 pound of uh, mutton. So if you use more, it will be longer. The pound spices. Reduce the heat uh, to number two. And make sure the heat is low, don't make it high. I'm going to add in the one tablespoon of cashmere chili. I'm going to add in the cherry tomato. I'm 
so uh, when you add in the cherry tomato you don't have to add in so much of the uh, yogurt because the sourness uh, is already there now i'm going to put in the yogurt just add in one cup quarter cup of yogurt this I'm going to add in one teaspoon of salt this is half teaspoon I'm going to put one teaspoon of salt I'm going to put my garam masala half a teaspoon Add in another half a teaspoon of salt. So when you come back, make sure you stir until you don't see anything at the base. So it's always good to come back every two minutes and stir your pot. I have another ten more minutes to go. I'm going to pour in uh, one cup of uh, water. Uh, because I realized that uh, the gravy is a bit thick. So I'm going to increase the time to another 10 minutes. I'm going to put quarter teaspoon garam masala. I did not use whole spice sauteing, that's why I'm putting in uh, garam masala now. I'm going to let it simmer further for another 5 minutes. The gravy is done. Try, share with your friend. Let me know in the comment. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. I shall see you in my next video. Bye.